Hello, everybody. I am thrilled to be able to be here with you. I am Sarah Marble, and I am a Diamond Ambassador with Plexus Worldwide. And I just wanted to chat with you for just a few quick minutes. <clears throat> you know, in network marketing, uh, I have been able to experience blessings like I never would have dreamed possible. Uh, this has been the most amazing adventure, and I'm thrilled that you guys are along for this ride. Um, to be here and be a part of a training opportunity, you're in the right place for sure. Um, that means you're wanting to take your business to the next level. So congratulations on that. I wanted to just chat with you for a second um, about some, some things that can be helpful in helping you to be su successful with your business. Um, it's been said that the key to success in network marketing um, is duplication. And it's true because if you have a lot of people doing a little bit, um, huge things can happen. So I might be great at personally bringing people in, at personally recruiting, but if my people that I'm bringing in don't do anything and they don't have the, the tools and the information that they need to be able to go out and do the same thing, I'm only going to be able to do so much and get so far. The beauty happens when we have this, um, what we've called in Plexus, the power of three. So if I find my first three and get to silver and then help those three go out and find three more, um, that would be three on my first level and then nine on my second level. And if those nine know how and what to do to be able to go out and get their three, that's 27 people on your third level. And if you can see how the numbers game works with that, um, that really is where the magic happens. So how do you help um, foster this duplication? Um, the very first thing that I can tell you is to keep things simple. There's no need to reinvent the wheel. Um, we At Plexus, we have amazing websites. We've all got the same website. And I have to tell you, um, that's where I get my information and that's where you should be getting your information too. It's straight from corporate. You know it's going to be compliant, you know it's going to be correct, you know it's going to be accurate. So don't feel like you have to go out and do all this independent research. Send them to your website um, and that's what we should be using. Um, you know we've got brochures and catalogs. You should be able to sit down and do an entire um, presentation with uh, somebody who's interested just using the catalog, flipping through the catalog. So make sure that you guys are not trying to reinvent the wheel. Uh, just keep it simple um, and use the tools that we have in place um, to be able to share. The great news about that is, um, you know, as a Diamond Ambassador, I could probably stand up in front of you and do a two-hour presentation and throw all kinds of, you know, wonderful information at you. Somebody sitting in the audience as a guest might think to themselves, well, I could never get up there, you know, and talk to this many people, and I could never, you know, do a presentation like she just did. We don't want to make anybody feel like this is something they can't do. So simple is good, because anybody can say, oh, well, you know what? I can take my products and be a product of the product, share my story with others, um, and teach them how to do the same thing. You know, it doesn't get any... Uh, simpler than that. So don't try to reinvent um, the wheel. And then the other is to have a plan. Uh, I think there's another saying that says you don't ever plan to fail, but you will if you fail to plan. Ooh, that sounds good. I don't know if that's how it goes, but um, oh well, that's what you get. Um, so you need to make sure that you have a plan in place. I have um, borrowed some information from some other amazing um, top leaders in network marketing from some mentors that have kind of taken me under their wing and given me some really helpful information. Um, the first being, um, if you have a plan on how you're going to share, um, Sarah Robbins says the 531 approach is great. Talk to five new people every day, follow up with three new people every day, um, and check in with one team member to see how you can support them. If you're doing that every day, one, you're going to be growing, and two, you're going to be able to help your team um, by checking in with them and following up and doing all of that good stuff. Um, so if, if daily is too much, if you don't have your um, plan, you know, your business hours are not such that you want to grow that fast, you know, weekly is fine, whatever you need to do for that. And then the other is to just kind of have a system that you walk through. When you get a new ambassador started, um, they, you need to know what their why is so that you can help them to be 
successful in reaching the goals that they have. So you need to know what their why is and then you need to know what their goals are. So I like to call that a business strategy session. Just sit down with them or have a phone call and say, hey, what would you like to get out of this journey with Plexus? Um, the next is to make your list. Everybody needs to have a list. You're adding names, people that I'm gonna share with, people that I'm gonna talk to. Don't ever prejudge. Make sure to keep that list growing as you are adding people, you know, your Facebook contests, your contacts, your phone contacts, um, people at your children's school. Just put those, write those names down so that you know that you're going to be talking to people. <clears throat> okay, so you're going to make a list and then you're going to start contacting people on that list. And then you're going to present Plexus to them. And like I said, it's as simple as showing them your website, showing them a link from the corporate YouTube channel, our product video, our compensation plan video, maybe throw in a diamond documentary in there. Um, all things that are easy, accessible, and we all can use the same things. Um, then you're going to follow up and then you're gonna get them started either as a customer or an ambassador. So if everybody on your team knows, hey, this is what we do, we make a list, and then we start contacting people on the list, you know, help, help with your upline is great, whether you do some three-way calls to kind of get some answers um, to questions that your prospect might have, maybe handle those objections and get them to move forward to making a decision. So making a list, contacting people on the list, presenting Plexus, following up. It's great to have some kind of system of follow-up. Um, I absolutely love my Erin Condren planner because when I talk to somebody, I can actually write down in my planner, okay, this is the day that I talked to them, this is what they said, um, and then you know, um, this is an average week of, see how it's, who I talked to, check marks, you know, did I do my follow-up information that I needed to know, um, so it really, really is a great way to have some kind of planner, paper, notepad, whatever, that you're going to keep a list of who you've talked to so you can um, follow up with those people. The fortune is in the follow-up, really. Um, so I hope this is helpful um, to help you to know how to um, keep things simple and hopefully help things to start duplicating for you. I'm really excited that you guys have some amazing things going on and I'm always here to help you guys out with whatever you need. So um, congratulations on your Plexus journey and you guys have an awesome night.